Hey, what up, YouTube? Hope everybody had a nice and safe New Year's. Gone is 2021. Now we're saying hello to 2022 with a brand new video. Now in this video, I got two places that I think you guys can put some brand new money. First place is in a company stock that I feel that is going higher in the very near future. Second place is what I call an investment vehicle of the rich. So if this is something that you're interested in finding out about, I'll see you on the other side. Stay tuned. Hey, what up, YouTube? It's your boy, the stock dude, back on the prowl again. Now, in the intro, I told you guys that I had one stock from a company that I feel is going higher. And I also had one, what I call the investment vehicle of the rich. So, first of all, I want to wish everybody a happy new year. Hope everybody had a wonderful time. Without further ado, the stock that I feel that's going higher in the very near future goes by the name of build a bear workshop incorporated ticker symbol b b w and it comes in at a price of 19 dollars and 52 cent per share now just to tell you a little bit about build a bear workshop incorporated they operate as a multi-channel retailer of plush animals and related products the company operates through three segments, direct to consumer, international franchising, and commercial. Its merchandise comprises various styles of plush products to be stuffed, pre-stuffed plush products. That's a tongue twister. And sounds and scents that can be added to the stuffed animals, as well as a range of clothing, shoes, and accessories. <laughs> They got accessories for stuffed animals. So the company operates its stores under the Build-A-Bear Workshop brand name and sells its products through its commerce sites. Now, as of January the 30th, 2021, it operated 354 stores, including 30 stores in the United States. Oh, no, that's 305 including 305 stores in the U.S. and Canada and 49 stores in the United Kingdom, Ireland, and also China. Now, believe it or not, people are real serious about stuffed animals. Just to show you that I'm not kidding, I got one of these little stuffed animals right here right now so y'all say hello to my boy snuggles now believe it or not people buy and collect these stuffed animals people serious about them trust me believe me when i tell you because i got some right here at my house but what i'm gonna tell you about these little stuffed animals is simply this people buy those stuffed animals like these they actually buy clothes and accessories for these stuffed animals. People collect them and they keep them for long periods of time. It's just like investing in like a Rolex watch. Over a period of time, the value usually goes higher. So these little snuggle-like stuffed animals that Build-A-Bear makes and or distributes can make you and make me potentially a lot of money my boy snuggles so this company called build a bear incorporated this is what they do so if you're interested you can possibly take something like snuggles and have the money that you make snuggle right up next to you so if this is something that you're interested in let us go to a zit chart Get down right here, Snuggles. Now, looking at the chart, 
of Build a Bear Workshop Incorporated. Ticker symbol BBW. Once again, it's coming in at a price of $19.52 a share. Now, I told you in the intro clip that I feel that the stock price is going higher. So now, I'm going to try to show you why I think it's going higher. If you look right here in this blue shaded area, that big green volume stick at the bottom, that right there tells me, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, Build-A-Bear Workshop price is going up. Now, I can't tell you when, and I can't tell you how high, but what I can tell you is that sooner or later, this price is going higher. Now, looking at my notes, Build-A-Bear Workshop Incorporated is a Zach's number one rated stock, and it has a $30 price target. Now, right now, it's trading at $19.50. Two cent and from looking at this chart once this price breaks above the $22.90 range let's just call it $22 once it breaks above $22 and closes above this big red candle this stock price is going higher once again I can't tell you what price is going to but it's going beyond what they expect because I can just see it right here on the bottom of the screen just by looking at the money that's pouring into this company. So once it breaks out above this area of resistance, let's just call it $22, this right here, it's going higher. So now the second place that you can put some brand new money to work is what I call an investment vehicle of the rich. Now the company goes by the name of PIMCO Dynamic Income Fund. PIMCO Dynamic Income Fund, ticker symbol PDI. And it comes in at a price of $25.91 per share. Now to give you a little bit about the description, PIMCO Dynamic Income Fund is a closed in fixed income mutual fund launched and managed by Allianz Global Investors Fund Management. So PIMCO is what's known as a closed-end mutual fund. Now just to give you a definition of what a closed-end mutual fund is, a closed-end fund is a type of mutual fund that issues a fixed number of shares through a single initial public offering, which is known by IPO. Now they use these shares to raise capital for its initial investments. Its shares can be then bought and sold on a stock exchange just like regular stock. But the, the key is this. When they sell those shares, no new shares, no new shares will be created. In other words, no new money will flow into the fund. So what that means is the key point is that the fund has a limited amount of shares to buy and or sell. Now having that set amount of shares helps to stabilize the price in order to continue to pay the healthy dividend of over 10% that PIMCO Dynamic Income Fund pays. That's right. I said they pay over 10% percent dividend now the way that the stock market is trading right now i'll be honest i'm not too comfortable with picking individual stocks right now because the market is all over the place and a lot of you are not that comfortable picking individual stocks as well so for those of you that don't just want an investment vehicle that you can put money into this right here is a place that you can put brand new money and wait it out until the market kind of gets its act together. Now this closed in fund, PIMCO, they invest in mortgage backed securities. So this is basically a way that you can be in real estate 
without having to actually be a landlord because they invest in the mortgage loans for single family homes and also businesses. Now, like I always recommend you do your research because closed end funds, they do have associated fees that you have to pay in order to be invested in the closed end fund. But don't sweat that because this dividend is more than enough to make up for any fees to make sure that that price is not offset by damaging the amount of money that you'll make. So do your own research and you can find out exactly what the fees are. But trust me when I tell you, I ain't telling you what I heard, I'm telling you what I know because I invest in it myself. You won't notice them fees when your account is grabbing hold of them 10% dividends each and every year. Let us go to a zit chart. And once again, PIMCO Dynamic Income Fund, ticker symbol PDI, comes in at a price of $25.91 per share. Now, once again, this is how the rich invest. So what I can tell you for a fact, being that this is how the rich invest, let me show you how I know that the rich is involved in this. This blue shaded area right here is letting me know that people who are concerned with inflation are pouring money into these types of funds. Now, these funds are designed to outpace inflation. So if you believe that inflation is going to be with us for a while, or if you believe that inflation is going to get worse, this is where you want to put brand new money at in a place that can keep up with the pace and the rate that inflation rises. Because trust me when I tell you, putting your money in a savings account, in a bank or a credit union, it ain't keeping up with inflation, Slick. It just ain't doing it. Only reason I keep money in a savings account is just to keep it from being up under my bed or from burying it in the backyard. Other than that, it ain't doing no good. Put some brand new money in a fund like this and that'll keep up or surpass the rate of inflation. Inflation, not inflation, inflation. <laughs> Let's just look at the chart. Now looking at the average volume, average volume for this fund is 535,000 shares bought and or sold on any particular day. But on the last day of trading, on Friday, you had 2.7 million shares bought and or sold going into the PIMCO Dynamic Income Fund. Once again, this is how the rich invest. Rich people know that inflation is here and it's gonna be here for a while. So if you wanna invest like the rich, you gotta pay attention to what the rich does. And looking at this chart, once this price gets above this resistance area of $26.50 is going to head higher up to the $27, $28 range. So if you got brand new money that you want to put to work and you don't want to have to worry about picking individual stocks, close in mutual funds are the way to go. Because when I was doing the scan for this video, I noticed a lot of closed in funds turning up on my scans. So a lot of rich people all around the world are pouring money into funds like the PIMCO Dynamic Income Fund. So that is the video. I hope you guys enjoy. And as always, I'm not a stock expert, nor do I claim to be one on YouTube. So please do your own due diligence and research and enjoy 2022. I'm the one known as the stock dude. I'll holler at you later. Peace.